George was diagnosed with type 1, I felt frightened. I felt really upset because this is my little boy um, and his world has turned upside down. Had no idea that it was a whole new regime of life, that there would be injections, sugar testing. George was very negative about injections, absolutely hated them, didn't want them. It's very hard then to sit and say, George, I know it's going to hurt, but you're going to have to do it. And to make him do it and to sit all of us in tears around a table, and that happened many times because we're making him hurt himself. George lost all his spontaneity, the sparkle. He had to have rigid time frames. When George was on multiple injections, we never got within range on his levels, and so we were always outside. Within five months of having his pump, we were within range, and now we're down to 6.8, which is just amazing, because we know that we're protecting George's long-term care. It also meant that he didn't have as many hypos because he had better control. George hasn't got anything outwardly showing that he's got this condition, so if he would have a hypo, um, and people didn't realise what he was, then they would think that he was drunk or on drugs. But with the pump, I feel more confident because I think if anything happens to him now, they can see that he's got a medical device attached and even though they won't know what it is probably, they will at least try and help him. I feel a lot more confident now George is on a pump because um, it's so easy to use. I know he's at ease with it. Um, and I know that now he won't skip injections. It's no effort, he just takes it out of his pocket does his insulin and we're now getting to a stage where George can actually take over the control from us so we can let go a bit um, and I think that's important for him because at the end of the day it's George that's living with it and he's got to grow with it. When George got his pump I think it just eased everything off of everybody. We didn't realise how much of him we'd lost so we actually saw it come back just through having his pump, the sparkle in his eye, his spontaneity, his confidence. It just changed the whole flow of the house. It was just that we could all sort of take a step back and breathe again and sort of live instead of it, it, it controlling us and, and leading where we went with our lives. I think pump therapy is amazing. I think it just changes your child's life. And I think when they're teenagers especially, they've got hormones, they're growing, um, and you've just got so much more flexibility with a pump. I'd say to any parents out there, if you've got a child with type 1, just look at it, try it. I don't think you'd ever go back. It's just amazing.